watu wangu this incident of an abiabo i don't know kama wewe una, unaelewa vile kunaenda a uh, guys mwenye hajasikia hii story you know it's all over sidani kuna mtu mwenye hajasikia but najua pia kuna watu wenye wanakuanga nyuma that is it you know uh, hii story imetrend kila mahali ya huyu mstana uh, she's uh, 16 years anaitwa an abiabo na she's the main suspect of uh, Eric Maigo. Eric Maigo alikuwa finance acting finance director uh, Nairobi Hospital. And uh, kizungumkuti yani hey, history yote ni kizungumkuti yani huwezi elewa. For the first time familia yake mamake ameongea akasema kuwa and hiyo uh, jioni yenye Eric Maigo aliuliwa kuwa and saa 5 usiku alikuwa huko kwa nyumba na mamake akasema hata walikuwa wamekosana juu ya chakula alafu and alikuwa amekaa nje but mamake venye alienda kulala and alikuja kaingia kwa nyumba na akachukua mattress na akafanya nini na akarala <coughs> so asubuhi uh, sisters and brothers waliamka uh, six wakaona hayuko na wakambia mama mama yao kuwa hayuko So uh si the DCI warienda na wakapata manguo za za ani huko kwao. You know, na sasa ikajulikana kuwa yeye ndio kwa zilikuwa mpaka na damu ukajulikana yeye uh, alikuwa yani she's the main suspect. But uh, unasikia mamake anasema 11 ani alikuwa home. Alikuwa kwa nyumba. Saa ile usiku a uh, Elik Maigo alipatikana kwa club fulani na wanawake wangapi watatu ndio nawaambia hii story ni kizungumkuti haya uh, video zenye zilitoka za kwanza zinasema kuwa uh, an alionekana six ndio alionekana but uh, inasemekana kuwa an alionekana akijump kwa the you know that residence mari elik alikuwa na ka 5 na i spent just 26 minutes just 26 minutes in that uh venye aliingia tu hivyo kuonekana sasa mara ya pili akitoka it's just uh 26 minutes so naona hii kitu yote it's kizungumko because najaribu kufikilia 26 minutes zimetosha umjana kuingia na kuua huo jamaa na alimfungulia aje nyumba ni relationship gani walikuwa nayo cuz lazima kukuwe kulikuwa na relationship kati yake na ali cuz alimfungulia aje kweli unaweza fungulia mtu mwenye hujui nyumba hakuna inasemekana kuwa uh, ali hakuwa na simu of which mamake amesema ali alisema alikuwa na simu na aka, aka wakamuliza but akasema ilikuwa hapo hapo sijui juu ya juu ya mtungi but wao hawaku hawakuipata mama yake hakuipata uh, you know venye walikuwa naiangalia hawakuipata but hapo awali ilikuwa imesema kana kuwa ali hakuwa na simu hakuwa na simu so ndio nawaambia history yote kuna kitu fiche kuna kitu fiche You know, watu wengine wanajaribu kufikiria like ni kitu ilikuwa brand although ukweli kuongea ukweli hii ni kitu ilikuwa brand cuz um msichana ukiona venye anaingia kwa hiyo building venye analuka by the analuka ni kama it's not the first time ukiangalia hiyo video vizuri venye analuka it's like not the first time ni kama ameluka tena eh um msichana kona just 16 years ali plan aje hiyo kitu yote mpaka kuamka usiku na kwenda kufanya hivyo does it mean amekuwa akifanya hivi maybe kuna kuna nini zingine amefanya maybe alikuwa ametafutwa karipwa aende akafanye hiyo kitu na hata ukifikiria alikuwa amelipwa akafanya hiyo kitu but hata kama alikuwa amelipwa boda huyu Eric alifungulia blanco because that time si sifikilii venye unaweza fungulia mtu aingie kwako kwa nyumba 5 akuje aingie kwa nyumba na hapjuani so lazima walikuwa wanajuana and pia kitu kingine hao wanawake watatu ndio akina nani ndio akina nani and what the relationship 
watu wengine maybe wanasema it's it's because of work maybe kazi kazi uh, maybe kuna watu walikuwa wanataka hiyo kiti yake hiyo you know, but mambo ni mengi mambo ni mengi acha niwaambie watu wangu uh, you know hii kitu nimejaribu kufikilia i'm try to think from uh, point a to point z yani mimi mwenyewe sielewi cause imagine 25 times kusta mtu alafu pia inasemekana kuwa hiyo hiyo kisu ilikuwa imemsab si kisu moja ni visu kadha na DCI walizipata cuz bado sijaona ripoti ya DCI cuz zina wa, inaambiwa ni visu kadha zilipatikana hello so hii kitu yote but actually to goje cuz uh, nimeona an alikuwa amepelekwa kwa kotini but uh, amepewa more uh, 12 days Uh, and yake kisiyake isikike kwa isikike tena na kufanyike uchunguzi but we watu wangu size yani mambo imekuwa mabaya mambo imekuwa mabaya you know uh, sometimes it's good to protect yourself kujua watu wenye unatembea na wao ni akina nani do you have real friends yeah. e mambo ya kupati size venye kumeharibika e mambo ya kushinda party eh? kushinda sako yako ya watu ha? jaribu kuwapunguza acha tu kuwe na marafiki tu kidogo si kumit kila mtu si kila mtu anakupendeanga mambo mazuri jaribu at least ukue na marafiki wachache na marafiki wenye unajua ni wa ukweli hata ukapata shida those friends will be there for you guys we iki tu imenistua but we it's it's just right wao msichana ni msichana mdogo sana for sure kufanya kitu kama hiyo ha yani msichana anaua mtu ni kama kuku hata si kuku kuku inakatangwa tu once na inakufa imagine visu hata ndio nilikuwa nasema kwani alikuwa na hasira gani hizo ni hasira gani zinaweza fanya mtu awe mtu hivyo visu 25 hivi 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 wa 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 <gasps> <gasps> na unaongezea zingine tano i no 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 hata kama ni hasila hiyo nimekata hapo kuna kitu hai by the way nilikuwa najiuliza huyu msichana na vinyana anaonekana amepalala jamani Nenye anaonekana amepalala hata nguo zenye amevaa ni ile troza ya ya ya, ya so mbili so moja na jampa hii jampa owe yani namwangalia tu hivi jamani nasema huyu mtu venye ame, amepalala na finance art in finance mtu mkubwa mtu mwenye anafanya ha? Nairobi hospital imagine so hapo hapo kuna kitu yenye you know kitu fiche maybe kwa hiyo nyumba kulikuwa na watu wengine na kama kulikuwa na watu wengine walitokea wapi kwa CCTV camera haziwaoni does it means maybe ni watu wanakaa na yeye kwa plot moja you never know na bona an akaenda akaingia huko hiyo masaa na akaenda akaingia that time na akatoka okay tuseme kama maybe yeye walikuwa na na watu maybe ad ageenda tu kwa hiyo nyumba kama tuseme kuna watu wenye wa hiyo plot hiyo hapo kwa hiyo plot walikosika ali angekuwa tayari kwa hiyo nyumba hange disk kutoka hizo masaa zote za usiku usiku kukuja na, na, na kutoka so maybe inawezekana kuwa and alifanya hii kitu tu peke yake but i'm just wondering hizo mara zote but inasemekana kuwa and hakuwa peke yake kulikuwa na watu wengine but au watu wengine bona hawaonekani kwa CCTV camera inawezekana kuwa waliingilia wapi ama maybe walikuwa kwa plot na kama walikuwa kwa plot bona an an hakubaki kwa hiyo plot so kuna kitu yenye haieleweki kitu yenye haieleweki we mambo ni mabaya watu wangu Mungu tu may God protect us may God protect us so guys mimi nitaachia hapo just comment below useme chenye wewe unafikiria what do you think about an na you know the whole incident unafikiria aje just comment below na tuendelee thank you so much love you